Hi guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to run large language models in uh, LM Studio locally on your computer. The advantage of doing this is you don't have to rely on the cloud and for example ChatGPT and Google Gemma. I mean you don't have to rely on online services. You can do it locally on your computer. So first of all, you need to open a browser and search LM Studio. Then uh, if you want the link, I'm going to leave it in the description of the video. You just click it. Uh, this tutorial is for the for Linux. So I'll download the Linux version. You also have Mac and Windows available as well. So you just have to wait for it to download. Then you open the folder. Uh, this is an app image on Linux. So I'm going to right click it, go to properties, executable as program. Going to turn that on, then right click and run. Uh, it, it open here on the another window. So uh, I'm going to be honest, I already tried to download the model that I was going to use, that being Llama 3.18 billion instructions in billion parameters. Um, but I don't know why the download is failing, so we're gonna do this manually. Uh, I mean, you can try it if you want. Uh, just click, there's gonna be a download uh, button like this one here or any model you want and just click it and wait. You're probably going to have success. Uh, I don't know if this is because it's in beta. I don't know. But let's do this manually then. You, you open your browser. You just come here. And then you go to the link right here. And then you copy it. And you paste it on a browser. And as you can see here, it's working. So. I mean, the problem is not my internet, not my DNS. I don't know what is. I was trying to troubleshoot it, but I was not successful. So, I mean, just gonna wait. This is the pre-standard model, uh, 4.6 gigabytes in size. Uh, the bigger ones, uh, for example, Llama, uh, 70 billion parameter or llama with four, uh, uh, 405 billion parameters are quite a bit larger. So you're going to have to keep that in mind. So we'll cancel this. Um, after the download is completed, you just go here to my models and show in file explorer. So this is going to, um, open the LM studio models folder and just, you just drag it, the, your model to it. Uh, show instructions and okay. I show instructions, a uh, repository, publisher, repository, model file. So, I mean, I'm going to just create example ones. I don't know what is the right publisher and repository. So I'm going to go Facebook because this is a Facebook model and repository hugging face. I think let's try it. Uh, Let's reopen the program. I hope this works. Yeah, okay. So, I mean, <laughs> we have here the model. Uh, I don't know what the, the correct word, uh, folders structure is, but you can use that if you want. But probably if you're running this on Windows or even Linux, when another version is released, you, this is probably going to work. I don't know why it isn't. So, I mean, 
then you come here to AI chat and select your model. Uh, in my case, it's the, um, the Llama 3.1 that I downloaded. You just click it. Um, you, you have here in the home page uh, the requirements to run each model. This is a eight gigabyte plus RAM model. And um, if you have a, a beefy GPU, it's probably gonna make this a lot more pleasant. Um, I'm gonna select here Markdown mode because it's prettier. And then I'm gonna try it. Uh, hello. What's your name? What is your name? Ethan, I mean, that's strange. I'm gonna search here a question in Firefox. Best questions to uh, ask AI models. Let's see. Can machines ever achieve true understanding? I mean, this is a good one. So let's ask Ethan. Uh, enter. What a profound question. While machines can process vast amounts of information and perform tasks with precision, the concept of true understanding is complex and somewhat subjective. I mean, that's not a good answer. But I mean, now you can just do what you want. Uh, this is going to save your chats if you want to review them later. And I mean, this is the video. It's a pretty simple video. Uh, this is a pretty simple app that simplifies the process a lot. And what I notice about this particular um, model is that it's very concise. Uh, it doesn't, as you can see here, this is a question that, for example, ChatGPT was going to write a lot of a whole essay to to explain it while llama it's very concise and just says what it needs to say so thank you for watching the video if you have any questions or doubts you can leave it in the comments and goodbye